6699 adds a new lawyer to his federal racketeering case defense team. According to court documents obtained by XXL on Tuesday, July 9, Quinn Emanuel or Kurt and Sullivan's Alex Spiro, who was the lawyer Jay-Z hired to help with 21 Savage's ICE case this past February, has officially joined Takashi's defense. He was added to 6699's team, which also includes Lancelot Saro, Don Florio and Emma Maya Greenwood, during a hearing in Manhattan's Thurgood Marshall Courthouse on Tuesday advertisement at the time he was hired by Jay-Z on February 6. Spiro said he and the rest of 21 Savage's team would do their best to make sure 21 would be released from Mai's custody. The rapper, who was arrested on suspicion of being an illegal immigrant on February 3, was released exactly one week after the hiring. For his part, 6699 is still sitting behind bars in federal custody, as he has been since he was arrested on federal racketeering charges on November 18, 2018. While Takashi initially pleaded not guilty to drugs trafficking, racketeering conspiracy, firearms charges and more, he changed his plea to guilty during a January 23 hearing for the case. As a part of his plea, he agreed to cooperate with the federal government in their attempts to identify his associates charged with similar crimes. All but two of the 11 people charged along with Takashi in the case have pleaded guilty. The only people who haven't pled guilty are Anthony Harvellison and Al Jermianuk Mac. As of now, 6699's federal racketeering case is set to go to trial on September 4. YNW Melly was arrested on two misdemeanor drug charges in South Florida on January. 3. One count was for possession of marijuana not more than 20 grams and the other count was for possession and or use of drug paraphernalia. YNW Melly turned himself into Miramar, Florida police on February 13 after being charged with two counts of first-degree murder for the shooting deaths of associates Anthony Williams 21 and Christopher Thomas Jr 19. Authorities believe Melly shot and killed them and that he and his associate, YNW Bortolin, staged the shooting to appear as a drive-by. During a search of PNB Rocks Ben Salem, Pennsylvania home on January 20, Cops found four pounds of marijuana, scales, packaging material, more than $33,000 in cash and a stolen .40 caliber Glock handgun. The rapper was charged with possession with intent to deliver, possession of narcotics, receiving stolen property, for the stolen handgun, criminal conspiracy and other related offenses.